The CAPE is cracking down on how businesses can advertise. Beginning a week from tomorrow, some of the things that you've been seeing for years will now be against the law. Foreign reporter investigator Dave Colbrook went to the council meeting tonight where a decision was made. Dave? You know all those people you see alongside the road waving and spinning signs around and doing cartwheels and all that? No more. Not legally, anyway. Come Tuesday, it'll be against the law. For years, there was no law in place about any of those roadside signs. A-frames and feather banners are not currently part of any ordinance. These are A-frames. These are feather banners. Right now, they're not legal. They're not illegal. Businesses have been using them for years, but come next Tuesday, Cape Council has put strict rules on them. Either allowing a business to use one A-frame sign or one feather banner 365 days a year, during their business of, uh, hours of operation. So they would have to take it down after 5 o'clock if they close at 5 o'clock? Correct. That means no more lining the street with these. Just one. There was a proposal to do away with them altogether. That can be kind of a detriment to some of the businesses. They need that because of either the proximity to the street or um, maybe there's they need something to help draw customers into their business. They also said stores can now have 50% of their windows covered in signs like this. Any more than that is a problem. Uh, the city deems that as a safety issue in case somebody's in there trying to rob that police don't have a clear view of you know what's transpiring. What the city eliminated is this, people standing around waving signs. But all of this has some wondering how and who is going to enforce all this, police or code enforcement. A very simple question, when can we expect code to be coming to us to double our staff. <laughs> Frank said next week, but... I, you know, I love what I see, but say that. <laughs> you, you've got a job ahead of you trying to enforce all this. You know, I'm in education. I'm looking at these, and I'm like, you know, how in the world are you going to police those window covering? You all start talking about glazing. I'm thinking about a donut. I mean, this thing is like, I have no idea. <laughs> the law goes into effect Tuesday, April 1st, which is next Tuesday. However, city officials say they'll be slow to enforce it until everyone understands the new laws. And oh, by the way, none of this affects realtors trying to sell houses. They can still do whatever they want when it comes to signs. Live, Dave Colbert, Fox 4 in your corner. All right, thanks, Dave. Now we want to hear from you on this. What are your thoughts about a business sign ordinance in the Cape? Voice your views when you call us, 206-FOX-4, or email us, news at fox4now.com.